Hi, my name is Kevin and I'm 24 years old. I found out about my son when I was 17 and I turned 18 in May. My son was born in April. When I got my son, I went to share a room at my family house, you know, and this was a temporary plan, you know, it wasn't something that was going to be long term. So I was a bit um, I'm worried that you know as he gets older I need to make sure that he has his own space you know this this is also part of his stability which the, the social workers they're the ones that were talking about this they kept saying stability your child needs stability if you're concerned about his emotional well-being stability is the first thing you should be looking at so I went to housing to get support I brought all the papers, I had all my documents, I had all the proof, I had the court papers. At this time my son was starting his um, new school in September, you know, and they said to me, we, we need you to bring your son so we can see him. And I, and I felt like that was very strange. Why, why do you need to see my child when I have all this evidence with me? I felt like they were undermining the court papers because it was just wrong, like you shouldn't, I shouldn't have to bring, I shouldn't have to take him out of school. So I explained to them if, if they needed me, if they wanted to see my son, that it would only happen after school. There's no way that I would take my son out of school. For him to go and sit inside a housing office just so that they can see that he lives with his father, it was wrong. They booked me an appointment after school. So I went there after school and then they saw him and things started moving a bit slow. I think it was about two, three months. I went back and I asked them, so what's happening with my situation? And so what, what they said to me was, the reason why they wanted to um, cancel my case was they didn't, f they didn't feel like I was deemed homeless. That was because I was living with, with my family in a room. You know, and they came to visit and it wasn't like um, a nice circumstance. It wasn't a very nice place to live in because I, I was actually um, sleeping on the sofa and he, my son was sharing the room with my cousin. So it wasn't like a very healthy place for him to be living at. So I went back to the council and I presented this evidence. The week after I came back, they said to me, oh, we'll give you a key. And I was shocked because I wasn't, I would, that's not what I was expecting. So I guess after all the evidence that I brought with me, it, it, they, they realized that, you know, that they needed to provide some support, they needed to support me.